Hello everyone, this is our 2019 Ford Mustang EcoBoost convertible with 56,040 miles. Really nice silver color, has just a little bit of metallic in there. I think it looks really nice. Front end just has a little bit of cosmetic wear on it, some rock chips across the front of the hood. Nothing serious that stands out. It's all very minor and insignificant wear, but it is present. There's no scuffs or scrapes on the front lip on the bumper. I think cosmetically it's in really good condition, especially having 56,000 miles. I'd say it's probably pretty average wear. Front driver's side fender. Looks good, no issues. Front driver's side wheel. Does have some rash, just a little bit. It's not anything heavy, it's real light. Driver's side mirror. Just a few small rock chips, nothing serious. Driver's side door. One small rock chip down there. Driver's side rear quarter panel. No flaws there, looks really good. Rear driver's side wheel. No rash, no cosmetic issues at all. Looks great. Moving around to the back, looking at the back bumper. It's in really good condition. I don't see any flaws. Tiny little trunk lip here, small scratch there. But other than that, it looks good. Back end is in great shape. Dual exit polished exhaust tips look nice. Passenger side rear quarter panel. Do you have a small scratch there? That is it. Oh, I do apologize. There's another scratch here that's really difficult to see. If you so much as even get your shadow on it, you can't see it unless there's direct sunlight on it. Rear passenger wheel. Looks good. Passenger door. No flaws. Passenger mirror. Same story as the driver's side, just a few rock chips on it but nothing very noticeable or serious. Front passenger fender. No issues there. And the front passenger wheel does have some rash. You kind of see there. And it's just that one little area that has wear on it. I'll go ahead and walk around the car from a one foot distance to give you a better big picture idea of the overall condition of the vehicle. Here at Exotic Motorsports, we like to do these comprehensive walk around videos to give our out of state buyers the confidence and peace of mind they need to purchase a vehicle from a site unseen if they choose to do so. Walking around a vehicle from a one foot distance is a lot more indicative of what you might notice on a day to day basis if you were to own the vehicle yourself and helps to separate the larger, more obvious flaws from the smaller, less significant ones helping to give you a better well-rounded perspective of the overall condition of the car. Overall, I'd say the car's in pretty good shape. Cosmetically on the exterior, it does have a little bit of wear, but it's pretty average for a daily driver and the mileage that's on it. Looking at the interior, do you have kind of a harder um, ABS plastic for the door panels and nice Leather inserts in the center with white contrast stitching. Express down windows for the driver and passenger side. Power mirrors, power locks. Power adjustable seats. Twilight sensing headlights. Very nice carpeted floor mats. Perforated leather seats that are heated and cooled. Take a look in the back real quick. Back seats look fantastic. Very good condition. This car is really easy to get in and out of. Uh, just the seat design and the uh, height of the seat versus your standing position. It's just really easy to get in and out of. 
No warning lights on the dash here. Everything looks great. We're at 56,044 miles. Dual zone automatic climate control. Heated and cooled seats, as mentioned. Push button start. Traction control, driving modes. Climate control, we do have Bluetooth. Voice command, Bluetooth controls there. Volume and cruise control over here. Signal, wipers. Does have paddle shifters here for the 10 speed transmission. Dash looks great. No weathering or sun fading. Auto dimming rear view mirror. Front passenger seat. It's also in fantastic shape as was the front passenger door panel. This is a uh, really easy to operate convertible. Just loosen up the handle, pull the top back a little bit, store the handle, bring the top back the rest of the way, and it will automatically fold up and latch in the back, and that's all there is to it. It is that simple. It's very easy to do. It's quick, it stows away nicely. Car looks great with the top down. Definitely gives you that traditional sports car look. One second here. It does have a hood prop. It's not the lightest hood in the world. There we go. So here's our 2.3 liter four cylinder EcoBoost engine, which is a great platform because you get the uh, added benefits of the additional torque and the nicer drivability with the turbocharger. But with it being such a small uh, displacement engine, it's only a 2.3 liter, you do get really good fuel economy as well. And that paired with the 10 speed transmission makes this a really fuel efficient vehicle while also giving you a certain degree of performance as well. So it's kind of the best of both worlds. It's not slow, but you still get good fuel economy with it which is nice, makes it a little more practical and easier to justify. So that is our 2019 Ford Mustang EcoBoost. Really nice car, pretty good shape. If you have any further questions, please feel free to check out this car on our website at exoticmotorsportsok.com. Thank you for watching.